Kenneth Welsh has died at the age of 80, his son has confirmed. Kenneth Welsh has died aged 80, his son has announced. His son, Devin Walsh, took to Twitter this evening to announce the devastating news. Devin made the announcement in view of his 10,400 Twitter followers. He pinned, my dad passed away on Thursday peacefully at home. I will always love him beyond words. He lived a wonderful life, he was the best father I could have asked for. And he touched so many lives. Please make a toast, watch a film, TV show he was in, celebrate a giant of acting. Many social media users took to the post's comments to share their sadness over the news and remember the late actor. Aaron Merkin said, I am so sorry for your loss. I directed your dad in a short and it was an absolute dream come true. He was incredibly generous and talented. His passing is a huge loss to the world. I've sent you a DM with the film in case you have any interest in seeing it. Public Strain 1 added, Devin, I'm so sorry for your loss. Your father's work brought so much joy to my life. Having lost my father, I understand that grief can be a complicated process, so please be gentle with yourself. All have you in my thoughts. H-E-R-R-I-S-S-O-N-E-Z commented, so sorry to hear about that Devin. I just saw Twin Peaks the series for the first time this year and it was and always will be a classic. Love every role in it. Love, Wyndham Earl. Your father's such a wonderful actor as well. Rest in peace. Sick. His cause of death is unknown at present. Kenneth played hundreds of roles on stage and on screen over the course of a career that spanned over 50 years. He was a noted character actor whose roles ranged from former American President Harry Truman to media mogul Lord Beaverbrook. However, arguably his most famous role was Wisdom Earl, a Twin Peaks actor who was fascinated by a nefarious strain of Tibetan mysticism. He also played the father of Catherine Hepburn in Martin Scorsese's The Aviator alongside Oscar-nominated Kate Blanchett. After Twin Peaks, Kenneth continued working even through old age, in films like Survival of the Dead to series like The Blacklist. 